A tale as old as time is coming to life on an area stage. The Colfax Drama Club presents Beauty and the Beast Friday through Sunday, November 3rd through the 5th at Colfax High School. Here's a quick peek at a recent rehearsal. And here now with more, our student actors, Nathan Basil, who plays Lumiere, and we have David Paulson, who plays Cogsworth. Thanks for being with us. Yeah, great to have us. So tell us a little bit, Nathan, what it's like to bring this classic fairy tale to life. Well, it's definitely an experience. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, I've done productions for a while, but this is def it's a whole new thing. It's such a well-known story, mm -hmm. and it's, it's definitely a lot to bring uh, such high expectations on stage. But it's so much fun too. It's, it's got to be a lot of fun because these songs, again, are something that a lot of people have grown up with or know. And and they, what, what's that like to to play or sing these songs? It's really interesting. I guess it's because everyone knows the songs, and it's so it's kind of like a like almost that feeling of like okay, they're expecting this. Everyone knows sure. the song, so we've got to get it down pat. But singing them in general, though, there's, I mean. Some of them are a little more complicated than you might oh, think, yeah, too, just the different parts going together. But overall, like, it sounds really, really good. Yeah, really love I mean, just, just with that little clip we saw, you guys sound like you're really meshing together. You had an orchestra, too, that's yeah, playing with 20 you. Yeah, so. 20 something Tw piece. Yeah. 20 piece. That's yeah. amazing. Yeah, that's a lot of fun to do that. And your costumes, I mean, great costumes. You're Lumiere, the candlestick, and you're the, the clock. Yep. So, I mean, that can't be easy. <laughs> well, I mean, you saw on the. Uh, on the video, yeah. there's I, I've got these hands. Yeah, they're made out of paper <laughs> mache, sticks. and there's a, a flame on the top. It's not an open flame, of course, but there's a little mechanism on the inside I can use to turn the lights on and off. Oh, okay. Uh, but they are so incredibly, unreasonably heavy. Oh. Like they're probably no more than a few pounds each. But it's a lot when you're sitting like this <laughs> for two to three a, hours. Two to th yeah, yeah. You're well, two to, to three hours at a time. Up. Sometimes four if we <laughs> go over time on rehearsal. And and you're you're the clock. So let yes. that and that has to be cumbersome too. Oh boy. Um, biggest problems with that costume, I'd say, are definitely maneuvering backstage and just kind of like <laughs> like I'm having to like sidewalk <laughs> and just kind of crab shuffle backstage and everything. And then going up the stairs on the set too, going up and down the <laughs> stairs. I'm like, you can't, you can't really see, see your feet all that well. So, I mean, good you're going to be doing realized. that now without the costume. You're going to be walking around like yeah, that because they're so yep, used to it. Much. Um, but you're you're encouraging, obviously, you know, the, the community, everyone to come out and see this. Oh, definitely, oh, definitely. of yeah. course. Yeah, there. Uh, it's been a lot of fun to put this together. I can imagine. Yeah. Yeah. Three months well spent. <laughs> Three months, exactly. And again, this is happening this weekend, uh, November 3rd through the 5th at Colfax High School. There are the times. We also have some more information online as well uh, to the Facebook page. Thanks again for being with us. Appreciate it. Yeah, thank you for having us. And we'll be right back.